be on the inside and nobody's can see it. Now these little blabs that are supposed to make the hat are seven, meter, seven centimeters down and six centimeters across. And this part, which is the, the what wraps around the hat, the end part of the beanie, depends on the measurement of your head. Since this is going to be the white part, I had to measure it where these two are together, which is going to be ten and a half inches. And then the other black part that I'm going to make is going to be 9 inches because my little man who I'm making this for, his head is only 19 inches. And then, well, I was just going to show you this and then I'll cut them out and show you what they look like when they're cut out. Alright. In order for Finn to stop whining, he needs to be put through a trial that forces him to take charge of a situation. to sew the accessories together, like the eyes and the nose and whatever else you're going to do first, so that way when you start finish, so you start on the hat, you can just super quickly put the, put the eyes and whatever on. I'd like to mention with the beak, there's a, it's not really any kind of shape. What I did was I just, sorry, <laughs> I'm doing this with one hand, was I kind of put it like that. And then, when you start to sew, you can just um, sew it close. You can make anything out of a triangle, pretty much. If you don't know how to sew, I will put up a link to show another channel that shows you all the techniques of sewing. Blanket stitching, cross stitch, everything. 
Well, alright, well, then I'm gonna start telling you this, and then I'll tell you the, the end result. Alright. <laughs> Since you stitch the eyes on using a felt stitch and your nose, you're going to want to move on to this, which you grab the both the pieces of your white felt or fabric and use a blanket stitch and stitch on the sides of them together so that way when you fold it out, it'll look like this. And I did the same thing for the black pieces. So that's the other. And I also stitch the rank of the rectangular pieces together so the black part for the for the back and then the white part for the bottom in the front <laughs> sorry and then we're gonna sew these two pieces together and when you're gonna sew that you're gonna have them together like this and then you're gonna do a blanket stitch from right here all the way around, connecting the top, and then all the way down here. Do not stitch it together at the bottom, because that's where you're going to put the this part, which I will finish telling you after I finish stitching it. Alright. For these pieces together, we're going to put away the eyes and the beak, which are not here. And then you're going to take that rectangle that you sewed together, the black and white one, and you're going to fold it in half like this, where they're together, and you're going to want to put it on the inside of the hat. Since I'm only doing this one-handed because I'm using my stupid phone, you're going to see half ass a little bit. And what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to sew all of this together, which I will show you in a few minutes. Well, a few seconds, technically. Alright. Here I go. Alright. Hey, Jin. I want to remind you what this dungeon's for. In order for Finn to stop whining, he needs to be put through a trial that forces him to take charge of a situation. Okay, now that you've sewn the rectangle piece on the inside, you see there, there it is, we're going to flip it out for the big review. Woo! If I can do it. Yeah, sorry. And there's your the white on the white, and the black on the black. Now, we can put on the eyes, and I'm going to have him looking that way. And I'm going to put his nose right about there. So there's your nose Now, what I did with the nose, because it's still like, it still was, would be smushy if you used it. Was I used all the extra string that came with, uh, with when you finished sewing? I stuffed it in there so it could be a little bit more non-pushable. So, after this, I'll show you what it looks like on my kid. Alrighty then. You have your very own Gunsu 